Hello Twin Flames and welcome to the DM to the F reading for Saturday. So I'm going to bring in two powerful decks of cards today from our soul sister Cherie from Divine Visions. We're going to bring in the Divine Yin Yang Oracle for Lovers and the Divine Confessions of a Broken Heart Volume 1. So these cards are really powerful because they show the light and dark aspects of the Divine Masculine. The things they are dealing with and struggling with and the things they really want. So the hopes and fears you know, the light and the dark, the yin and the yang. And the divine confessions are really things they want to express from their heart, things that may have hurt them and broke their heart that they want to get across to you. So thank you, angels. What's the energy today, please? There we go, one card. Wow, it jumped out. What do the masculines want to say to the feminine, please, angels, today? What do they want to say to you? I'm waiting for clear cards to jump out here. Here we go. I've only got two cards coming out. So the masculine is saying to you, he's saying in the light, I have the strength to face what matters and I'm willing to work with you. So this is an energy of compromise. I am willing to work with you. Now, this just really resonates because in today's Divine Masculine reading, I spoke about Sandy and Danny in Greece. And that's why I'm wearing this wig because I'm embracing my inner Rizzo today from Greece. We're being guided to be more playful and have some fun. So what Danny and Sandy do is they meet in the middle you know she knows she wants him and she has to change he knows he wants her and he has to change so they both go in it together and then they realize they just compromise so he has the strength your masculine is saying to you I have the strength to face what matters to stand up for what I believe in to fight for this love and I'm willing to work with you and work this out and you know come together and talk about the future, and make plans, and really compromise, so in other words, he's saying it doesn't have to be all his way, it doesn't need to be all your way, you're going to come to a balanced compromise, a more balanced approach, and in the darkness, he's saying, I feel so overburdened, and so exhausted by our unresolved issues, so he wants to sort it out, he wants to clear the air, he doesn't want it to be this way, and you know this too, you know, you feel overwhelmed and burdened of iron feminine and exhausted because you don't want all of these unresolved things between you. You want to sort things out. You don't want this energy where it's up and down, in and out, back and forth, or he's ghosting you and not talking to you. You want to talk about it and sort things out. So that's the energy what's coming in. The masculine's knowing they have the strength to fight through their fears resolve things come to a compromise and make a plan so this is also about communication coming in so i love how deep the messages are getting because you know the masculines have made it very clear how they feel about you and now they're resolving everything in their physical world they need to resolve to make it right and real and that's why it's a bit intense here and that's why this day we're being reminded to have playful energy to not make it so serious because it could be a serious day if we allow it to be, which means we take things personally. We operate in fear and struggle and pain. So the angel's saying, be lighthearted, do something that lifts you up and makes you laugh and brings in fun energy. He's saying to you, I'm afraid of intimacy, but I want to be close to you. Of course he wants to be close to you. They give me that song by is it Maxi Priest? I just want to be close to you. So he wants to be close to you. And he's afraid of sometimes opening up because he wants to be close to you so much. So this is him saying to you, of course I want you. Of course I want to love you. But I'm a little bit afraid of what that means. So that's why he can hold himself back. Also because if he's still with someone else or you know he's still freeing himself up for you, he doesn't want to be intimate just yet with you because he doesn't want to seem to be leading you on or letting you down. He wants to be free and able to give to you fully in that moment. And he's saying, I would need to learn more. Can we talk? So he's interested in the journey. He's interested about learning more about Twin Flames. He's interested in understanding what the future holds. Can we talk? So again, there's that energy there. He's worried that you may not answer the phone or you may not reply or you may shut him out or shut down on it because he's saying, can we talk with a question mark? So this is showing you he wants to communicate. He wants to come forward to you. He wants to clear the air. He wants to resolve things. 
he wants to open up because not being able to do that and not coming forward to do that is hurting him it's causing him pain and burden and struggle and stress and he wants to resolve all of these unresolved issues just like you do can we talk so again there's this energy where he may be silently calling to you like a silent distress call saying contact me reach out to me divine feminine because then it's easier for him don't make it easy for him divine feminine let the masculine make that move let them reach out to you let them be in that energy where they're a bit insecure if you're going to answer the phone or if you're going to you know accept their call or you're going to reply to their message because they make you feel like that constantly and they need to feel it too not like a taste of their own medicine where you're doing it to punish them or make them see in a you know karma type of way this is they need to understand the things they do their actions and the way they behave have consequences and that's what they're feeling right now they're feeling all the darkness about you know you not talking and there being unresolved issues between you when all they really want to do is work with you and that doesn't just mean work with you as in have the same career or business even though that possibly will be in your future this is working together talking communicating loving each other being a team because that's what you are you are a team you're a team in union but you're also a team before union on the 5d energetically when you're connecting when you're trusting in love so he's saying i have the strength to face it and to face what matters which is you and sort this out so he wants to face you he knows it's going to take courage he knows it's going to take determination and bravery but he's saying i'm willing to face you and talk to you and talk about our future even if that makes me feel vulnerable and a little bit afraid of intimacy because he's afraid he's afraid of the power and the love he's afraid of the power that you have over it he's afraid but what i can hear outside as well i don't know if you can hear that down the road there's like one of those it's not like a bulldozer but they're kind of removing things from the ground it's like roadworks or they're doing something in the in the street and that seems to follow us around as divine feminines when things are shifting and changing because that's archangel nathaniel moving things out of the way and as i said it, it stopped making the noise so the angels got my attention like they always do with things that you need to hear so this is about things coming up to the surface things being resolved things being sorted out so i feel this is clearing the air this is what the masculine wants this is what he wants you to know he wants to clear the air he wants to resolve any unresolved issues he wants to talk about the future he wants to be close to you even if he's struggling with intimacy right now because of whatever reason which is mainly because he wants to give you everything he doesn't want to be back and forth back to a karmic partner back to you in and out of his emotions he want to be honest and he wants to be open and he wants to love you so it's like he's saying let me love you divine feminine in my own time i hope this helps have a great day and i'll see you soon